here I started a fresh video of my goats, of Ayla's goats. These are my daughter's goats. Grandma gave both the kids some money and they went back home to visit grandma. And Ayla bought these two goats with them, with that money. But I think I've been paying for the feed. And we did need a vet visit once. We had diarrhea shit when we first got them. And the vet said that's because they got weaned off of mother's milk too quickly or all of a sudden that we were supposed to give them, continue giving them some milk. I'm not sure if cow milk would have sufficed, but the people that sold them to us said, nah, nah, you don't gotta give them anything, they'll be fine. Next thing you know, their, their backsides, look at their butts all clean now. Now that used to be like real nasty shitty when they were had diarrhea. You guys wanna tussle a little bit for the cameras? Nah. We'll have to catch you some other time, huh? They are hilarious when they jump up in the air and do their little sidekicks. I have to catch that on 4K 60 frames per second one time. I think this guy's cuter. His hair is all, her hair is all poofy. Chew that. They always had the, what the fuck are you looking at look when you first put the camera on their face and they're like chewing nothing in their mouth. Hey, can you give me that look? Are you guys hungry? Hey Miss Honey. Why are you guys so itchy? What is it? Fleas? Ticks? Lice? Huh? Uh, four cats, two large dogs, and I get one of those extra large dog advantage two things off of Amazon. And I split them all evenly. Not even whatever their weights are. I think the cats they get one milliliter, 0 0.8 milliliters. The big dogs they get two to two and a half milliliters each. I just got these one milliliter syringes, cut those advantage bottles. It says not to do that obviously, but you know, that's for the average Joe who doesn't know how to read the or you know, figure out how to divvy it up. And I'd save myself a lot of money. I think, what is it, 60 bucks for an extra large dog, 60 bucks for a small dog, and you get like five times more in the big dog one, or extra large dog one, and you can just split that amongst your cats and dogs. It even says it on the uh, labeling that you're not supposed to give them to the cats, but if you buy the cat kind, you look at the ingredients, Exactly the same thing, just a different, um, you know, concentration. So, you get to save a lot of money that way. Now, it's Advantage 2. Don't mix it with Advantix. My father-in-law did that. Steph's dad gave Advantix to the cat once. This was, oh God, 15 years ago. And you have to spend a pretty penny in the vet trying to fix him, and cat was never right after that. You always told he had some brain damage, so. Advantage ticks, you don't give the dog kind to the cats. An advantage, as long as they keep their formula what it is, it's safe on dogs and cats. Or at least it's the exact same formula for dogs and cats. 
Now I've given the extra large dogs and split them up amongst them. They're over here here now and none of them went through a crazy phase or showed any symptoms of not doing too good. I began mumbling. Come on, let's go. It's a good hour for videography. Now the sun is setting. We still have the sun. In a few minutes, the video will start to look fuzzy. Not enough light to do a nice video in a few minutes. Right now, you can just watch Fluffy enjoy chewing the air or whatever it is in his mouth. I'll just keep silent for the rest of the video. In fact, I'll start a new video. So follow the playlist and jump onto the next video. I kind of organize them pretty nicely. The file names are dates and the hour. No, dates and the sequence it goes in. So the next video will be all nice and soft. I'm watching this guy. Enjoy the sunset. Have a lovely evening.